In two weeks, we celebrate Constitution Day. The Constitution is a crime! What's it ever done for us? We the people! We the people! What's the Constitution, Dad? It's a document our laws are based on. My teacher says the Constitution's old-fashioned and needs to be replaced. Replaced with what? She did not say. I don't think I've ever read the Constitution. Don't feel bad. Neither have I. Interesting, isn't it? Members of Congress actually reading the Constitution and its headline news. Today at the coffee place, I met this guy and something really bizarre happened. Hop to, man. Time's a wasting. Where are we going? We're going to have some fun. What the heck is it about the Constitution? Now, let's just chew on that for a while and enjoy the scenery. If you're going to understand anything about the Constitution, you have to know something about where it came from and why and how. This is my friend Ben. Where are we going, Ben? To see amendments to the Constitution in action. Been to church, have you? Yep. First Amendment's alive and well. The right of the people to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed. <laughs> Who are you? It's the Third Amendment. No soldier shall in time of peace be quartered in any house without the consent of the owner. Pardon me, sir. Do you have a warrant? We don't need no stinking warrants. Oh, I beg to differ. What am I supposed to do about any of this? Your country's in a mess. The Constitution needs to be restored to its rightful authority. There's definitely a story here. Let's get this paper out. You gonna let them shut you up? Not on your life. The people who broke up the mayor's event, if they had a grievance, they should have petitioned the government, not torn the place apart. Son, you are well on your way to becoming a constitutional scholar. 